Belden Community Day Classic is just around the corner, so let's dive into an essential guide to the event. Starting with the dates, this event kicks off on Sunday, August 18 from 2 to 5 pm, and Belden will appear everywhere in the wild with the shiny rate being 1 in 25. There are always a future move in this type of events, and to this one the future move is Meteor Mesh. If you evolve with them to a Metagross during the event or a few hours after, you will get the Metagross that learn the exclusive charge attack Meteor Mesh. If you have a Shadow Metan, you can evolve it to a Metagross to learn this exclusive, exclusive move, but only that if your Shadow Metan does not know the move frustration. If it's so, it will not get, that, get the move Meteor Mesh. Meteor Mesh is a great move and makes a Metagross a top tier Pokemon because Meteor Mesh in trainer battles has 100 power and only need 50 energy, making it very powerful and on raid battles it has 100 power. For the event bonus we will get 1 quarter HD chests when eggs are placed into incubators during the event. Your models and incense activated during this event will last for 3 hours and take a few snapshots during the community day for a Beldum encounter. As always, there will be a paid ticket worth of $1. If you buy this ticket, you will get encounters with Beldum, Mutang and Metagross and get some good rewards. In my opinion, the paid ticket is worth of the money. During the event and by spinning a pocket stop, you will get some few research tasks that rewards you with Beldum encounter, 5 Great Balls, 2 Ultra Balls, 2 Pineapple Barrels or 500 Stardust. There will be some pocket stops with showcases of Belden. Two bundles will be available during this event. For 1350 Pocket Coins, you will get a bundle with 50 Ultra Balls, 5 Super Incubators, 1 Elite Charge PM and 5 Lucky Eggs. And for 180 Pocket Coins, you will get another bundle with 30 Ultra Balls, 1 Incense, 3 Super Incubators and 1 World Model. Let's move in into some tips and tricks. Let's begin with the most asked the question. What will be the CP for 100% IV Beldum? On screen, we have a full list of all CP for a hundo, but there are only 3 that we care about. If you found a Beldum that it's weather boosted, its CP will be 905 by level 35. If you catch a non-weather boosted, its CP will be 837 at level 30. And lastly, if you found a Beldum on field research, its hundo CP will be 418 at level 15. Is Metagross any good? The direct answer is yes. Metagross is a great variety attacker, being a steel and psychic type. In the steel category, Shadow Metagross is current rank 2, falling behind to Dusk main Necrozma. And Regular Metagross is a rank 3, falling behind to each Shadow version and Dusk main Necrozma. In the psychic category, Shadow Metagross is current rank 5 and Regular Metagross rank 15. An obvious thing is that we need to power up these bad boys, so let's see some tips to grind some candies. First of all, always use a pineapple berry or a civil pineapple berry. You can use Palkia's special ability, special rain, to double the spawn radius. In this type of event, with these rare and powerful Pokemon, Palkia ability is not that expensive. The cost of dust and Palkia candy or rare candy is worth the grind of Beldum candy or the Shadow Beldum. Next one is to mega evolve a Pokemon that has reach a max level on mega level. If you use a max level mega pokemon, you get 2 more candy, more XP per catch and up to 25% for candy XL. Being a psychic and steel type, you can mega evolve mega lakazam, mega slumbro, mega steelis, mega sizer, mega gandervar, mega agron, mega medician, mega latius and mega latius, mega rayquaza or mega lucario. There is another reason for grind beldum and the reason is mega metagross. Yes, metagross will be able to mega evolve into mega metagross. Mega metagross will be really good when it's released and will be a number one steel attacker and number two psychic attacker. You definitely won a team of this powerful metagross. Yeah, the bonuses aren't that good, but the Pokemon is really really good and it's definitely one of the most important Pokemon released in the game. Also, if you like this type of content, please click on that like button and leave a comment with your opinion about this event. And the most important of all, I hope that you get a Hundo, a Shiny or a Shundo that you're looking for. 